Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying some Archer Farms limited time only foods. Uh, I have the pumpkin spice cream filled rolled wafers. And I have trail mixes. This is the candy corn crunch trail mix and the savory mustard trail mix. These were uh, $3.50 a piece, so no matter if you bought these rolls or if you bought the trail mix, it was still $3.50. So we have tried other brands of these uh, pumpkin spice rolls in the past. So when you open it up, you get two, two of these packages. So I'm gonna let you open one. Two packages. And a tip. Yeah, and you get to keep the tin. If you know, if you if you have something that you want to put in there, a lot of times at Christmas we make Chex Mix or we make cinnamon pecans. This this would be a good container for either one of those. If you know, if you want to make fudge, you could stack your fudge up in one of these. And um, the anyway, I like tins. It says celebrate fall with the rich, creamy taste of Archer Farms pumpkin spice cream filled cream filled rolled wafers. These deliciously crisp cookies are filled with comforting flavors for a satisfying snack, perfect for the fall get togethers or quiet coffee breaks. For an indulgent bite sized fall snack, reach for Archer Farms cream filled rolled wafers. The, uh, Archer Farms is a Target brand, so we bought all these at Target. And there are nine servings, three wafers are 150 calories. So they're 50 calories a piece. No fibers though? Pumpkin so spice. nine times three is 27. So you get 27 of these. It's got a little bit of pumpkin spice mm. to it, but mm -hmm. not really super strong, but it's, it's there. But it's not like overpowering or anything. It's a, it's a nice light pumpkin spice flavor. Mm-hmm. I like yeah, the See, to me it's a little, I think it's a little stronger than what Kevin well, thinks. Really? I, but I, I like it. it but mm -hmm. I really taste the pumpkin pie spice. Mm -hmm. But I love that um, the creaminess too, mm -hmm. and the and crisp. The crunch of the yes, is really good. That is very very good. Um, yes, they're definitely a good little crunchy snack. And people will ask me, how do these compare with the other ones you've had? I don't remember them. Even <laughs> if they were just last year, you know, I would have to have them side by side, um, and and have them here to compare. I do not know. I can tell you for these though. I think they deliver on the pumpkin spice flavor. I think they're very good. Yeah, the, the flavor's there. It's For me, it's a little light, but, you know. In 50 me. calories per wafer, <clears throat> that's that's actually not bad. Yeah, because um, they're pretty good size and they're, they're heavy. Yeah, they are. Um, so, yeah, I don't think that's bad at all. So, which one of those do right. you try? Um, this is the candy corn crunch and the, the savory mustard. I want to say the candy corn crunch is 9.5 ounces. The, the savory crunch of mustard is only 5.5 ounces. It's very, very light and small by And they're all 350, light. no matter yeah. what size, 350. Okay, candy corn crunch trail mix with honey roasted peanuts, candy corn raisins, and white chocolate pretzel balls. Eight servings are in the container, a fourth cup, 34 grams, is 150 calories. 34 grams. So we are gonna weigh it out so that you get a visual. Cause I think that's helpful. It's way over. I went way over. Unfortunately, that's way over. Still way over. Take away a big M and M. What is that? That's 33, so that's 35, so, <laughs> okay. So that is how much you get. A, a small handful mm -hmm. is how much you get for your calories. So, honey roasted peanuts, candy corn, raisins, candy corn, Still my candy corn. raisins, um, white chocolate pretzel balls. That must be what these are, white chocolate pretzel balls. Okay. Peanuts, raisins, candy corn. And yeah, four things. Okay. You just have more peanuts in your hand. Mmm. Very sweet. It is. And I like the little bit of salt you get from the, the peanuts, too. Mm -hmm. um, 
I don't like the that texture peanut, of the candy corn. That peanut adds a lot. It does. If it didn't have the peanuts in there, it would be, I wouldn't like it even at all. Because it does give it some saltiness. I don't like the candy corn in there because the candy corn, it gives a chewiness to it. I, I don't know. It's just, um, it's a it's a weird texture to have with nuts and raisins. <laughs> that is a and very- And crunchy peanuts. That's a very, it is a very chewy candy corn. Yeah. It's good. I like the flavors of it. The, the texture of the candy corn is the only thing that throws me off a little bit. It's so good. Yeah, it, um, that is not Brock's candy corn. Uh -huh, it's, it's, um, like a Yeah, chewy you can one. tell Brock's candy corn, and that's not it. I don't mind it. I, I actually like that mix. I think it's good. I would eat it. Oh, yeah, I like um, it. Like I said, just the texture is a little mm -hmm. different. I like the candy corn in that more than the great value candy corn in theirs. Yeah. Because we had some, um, one of those new great value from Walmart, one of those uh, trail mixes, and the candy corn just was not good in it. Mm, it didn't and, taste good. And it's funny because Andrew, we let him take those bags home with him because he did the review with us. It was the one, the, there was a maple one and a harvest one. Mm -hmm. And he said that Gavin, Gavin loves candy corn, and Gavin didn't even like the candy corn in that one either. He said, I don't like that. The quality <laughs> was just not there. So, even though this is not the best candy corn, I still like this mix, and I would still eat this mix. Yeah, it's good. But just know that it's not Brock's candy corn. But I still like it. Oh, I'm not saying I wouldn't eat it. It's just... Um, it's very sweet. Just a little different when you're chewing it. Yeah. Okay, this is a... Like I said, it's a tiny bag. Savory mustard trail mix with seasoned pretzels, peanuts, almonds, and rye chips, and pretzel sticks and twists. This sounds like those Snyder's mm -hmm. of Hanover, um, yeah. the little pretzel, uh, mustard pretzel. A third cup, 29 grams is 150 calories, and there's five servings in there. Yeah, but I mean, it's, it's 29. A, the bag feels like something you get on an MRE. Yeah. <laughs> That's 31, so take probably one thing. There's 28. So, Doesn't that feel like an MRE bag? It does. So another uh, small handful. So, okay, we get pretzels, peanuts, almonds, and rye chips. Pretzel stick, pretzel twisty. Give me a big rye chip, I like these. These are my favorite. Peanut. And a regular peanut. Pretzel, peanut, almond. And then you get these pretzel pieces like this. Pretzel sticks and pretzel twists. Oh, I didn't get a, a big hump like that. Yeah, that's it. I think that's it. That's a, gonna be a big old mouthful. Good grief. Wow. They say savory mustard is almost like a spicy mustard. Mm-hmm. Well, It's a very vinegary mustard. Mm-hmm. It tastes like oh, a... I like it though. Mm-hmm. But you have to like mustard. Oh, yeah. If you don't like mustard, you're going to hate it. Mm-hmm. This is like dipping in pure old yellow mustard. This is like a um, grape coupon. Yeah, it's very strong. Yes, this isn't yellow mustard. This is like your... It's your, true. It's your strong Dijon. Yeah, this is like grape coupon Dijon mustard. Yeah, it's got a... It's got almost a bite in the back of your Yeah, back of your it's throat. not spicy, so don't think it's hot. Yeah, no, but it's that not makes hot it seem spicy. Hot. But it is a, it's just very, very seasoned. If, if you've ever had a specialty mustard, some people only want to use yeah. specialty mustards. Yeah, if you like um, those, you'll like these. Yes, uh, I think it's good. Uh, of course, um, I'm. And have a sweet tooth, so I like this one better. I like the candy corn crunch, and I love those pieces of the white chocolate pretzel balls. I love those. I thought that was good. Um, that was just a, a really good mix, even though the candy corn isn't the best quality. I still think it was a very, very good mix. Um, I think all three of these are good. Like Kevin said, you're you're getting um, almost half a smaller bag of that. Um, but if you would rather have savory than sweet, then then that is it's very good. You just need to like that, like that mustard. <laughs> um, but I like these. I thought the the pumpkin spice rolls were good. Out of the three, I'd buy those over anything else. These mm -hmm. that's saying the, a the lot. The rolls. Because you didn't think these were that strong. The mustard's pretty strong, almost too strong. So for it's me. too strong for you to enjoy. And, and I would pick 
so much of that. I would pick it yeah. so much and leave the candy corn without eating it. And not eat the candy corn. Yeah, which is not bad. It was like I said, it was the, the flavors are really good. But if something to just grab and eat, I'd probably get the sticks. Mm -hmm. Um, for me, I would pick this. Yeah. I mean, I like the sticks. The the savory mustard would be my last choice, it only be because good. I'm gonna pick something sweet always yeah. before I pick something. It's like just too that. strong for me. It's very um, must, very strong mustard. Right. So um, I hope you enjoyed the video. Like I said, you can find all of these things at Target. They might not necessarily be back with the Halloween stuff. You have to scour the store and just kind of see where they've set stuff up. Um, it could be anywhere in your store. So I hope you enjoyed it and thanks for watching.